So this entire chapter has been creating your brand. And I wanted to ask you, Caroline, if you had any advice for our viewers on consistency, because that seems to be the underlying theme in this chapter. It's a process that naturally takes time. You have to give yourself time, you have to be patient with yourself, and you have to be flexible knowing that this process never ends really. Like as an artist, like, you know, we're constantly being influenced by things that happen in our life and our life experiences shapes us. And so you have to be flexible to develop along with life. Mm -hmm. And your style is going to be, you know, slowly changing and evolving. I think the underlying feel will be the same, but that it can change. And that initial process of finding your voice, you know, it's a very personal journey. Mm -hmm. Some people like find it I've seen some people from my, some of my workshop attendees, I've seen like almost overnight, like they go home after the workshop and get a new site up and it's like, whoa, wow. uh -huh. that's their voice, you know? And some, it's a, it's a slower journey. And I think that's just the nature of life of, you know, how one knows each, themselves, right? So just, yeah, give yourself time, keep experimenting, keep shooting and just keep paying attention to what you're naturally drawn to in your work and consistently deliver the stuff that you, you do like. So how long have you been taking photos professionally? I think eight years now. In the very beginning of those eight years, did you feel like you, kind of, you already knew what your voice was or did it take some time? I felt like I knew what I wanted my business to look like in terms of the relationships that I wanted, but I think in terms of like visual style that took a few years to develop. It took two years before I knew where I wanted to be and it took another year to really start getting portfolio work to look yeah. like that. Okay, so about three years to really develop into the brand that you are now. That's yeah. really interesting. So I guess the biggest takeaway is just to be patient. 